Taryn Waugh. I am the chef and one of the owners of a catering company in Vancouver called Savory Chef Foods. And we're at our um, production kitchen in the pastry area today. And today I am going to make congee. Uh, so the basis of what we're doing, our theme is uses for leftover turkey from Thanksgiving. And something my mom always used to make after Thanksgiving or Christmas or any time we had holiday or turkey was turkey congee. Now congee is a rice-based soup uh, very popular in Chinese cuisine and actually all over Asia. And we normally eat it for breakfast, um, but you know it can be really at any time of the day. And so basically, I'm not going to show you um, how to make it because it actually is just turkey stock that you make from the bones of the turkey and uh, with rice. So it's about four, three quarters of a cup to not, of rice to nine cups of water or of stock, I mean. And you just really boil it and simmer it until it gets really, really thick, almost like porridge. Okay. So this is our finished congee. Usually takes about an hour to um, an hour and a half, two hours. Uh, so I'm going to add in some leftover turkey meat. This can be the breast or thigh or whatever you have left over. As well as uh, some blanched bok choy. Nice to have a little bit of green or vegetables in it as well. Okay, so we're just gonna let this heat up and come to the simmer. Uh, you can cook the vegetables right in here, but just uh, to make it a little bit quicker, I've blanched it ahead of time. Okay, so while that's cooking, I'm just gonna talk about a couple of the garnishes that I have. Um, to put on it. I've made some homemade chili garlic oil, which is super simple. You just take vegetable oil or canola oil and uh, heat it up, put in some chopped garlic, let that start cooking until it becomes quite fragrant. And then just before it looks like it's gonna start to brown, you throw in some chili flakes and you get that, let that get nice and toasty and there's your homemade chili garlic oil. Uh, we're also going to add some uh, Japanese style soy sauce marinated eggs. So I've boiled these to about medium, peeled them, and then marinated them in a mixture of soy sauce, mirin, sake, and some sugar. Let that sit overnight. And I actually like to keep, you know, five or six of these uh, in my fridge at the beginning of the week, and I'll just eat them as a really quick snack, maybe with some rice. And then we're also gonna do some uh, green onion that I've julienned, and some turkey crackling. So I've taken the skin from the roasted turkey, uh, baked it until it's crispy, and then just chopped it up. So really simple, really quick, um, really nice quick meal, maybe lunch or something that you can make with all your leftovers. And after your big Thanksgiving meal, it's kind of a little bit lighter, a little bit healthier. Um, we often eat congee when we're sick. So kind of look at it as a healing food. Okay, so I'm going to take this egg and cut it up. You can see it's nice and gooey and gooey. A little green onion. Have our turkey crackling, which is really my favorite part. And then just a little bit of that chili oil, depending on how spicy you like it. There's my turkey congee.